certainly some really frightening moments for those people who are on that bus. There are signs that very clearly say that trucks over nine feet, four inches should not turn onto this one way street Edison place. But you can see right here where the bus hit that overpass around midnight this morning, significantly damaging the front portion of the bus. Let's show you some video from earlier. You can see just how mangled the bus was after impact. It appears the roof on the front was sheared off. Windows were broken, sending glass raining onto the passengers inside. Between 40 and 50 people were on the bus at the time of the crash. Some of those passengers describe for us what happened. Well, the bus hit, hit, hit it and uh, everything inside crashed. Uh, everything a mess. Uh, all crashed. The, 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 the glass is like crashed and everything like, falling down. People yelling, kids crying. I'm sleeping and it was like sudden sudden jerk and I was like I was in a shock and everyone like everyone everyone face is like bleeding and passengers say those who were sitting in the front were the ones who were most seriously hurt. Police confirming this morning that 50 people were taken to area hospitals with non life threatening injuries. Now, we did reach out to the operator of the bus company called Our Bus. So far, they have not returned our request for comment. We're live this morning in Newark. Janelle Burrell, CBS 2 News.